Welcome back to Yumper and Swole's 31 Days of Horror, presented to you by the Sadistic Penguin Studios. Did you ever want to be able to tell the future, past, or present? What's your prediction for the fight? Then? Prediction? Yes, prediction. Pain. Today's film dives into the subject. We are talking about the 1983 science fiction horror film, The Dead Zone. Why won't you die? The film is directed by David Cronenberg and based off the novel of the same name by the king of horror, Stephen King. It stars Christopher Walken as Johnny Smith, Brooke Adams as Sarah, Tom Skurrett as Sheriff George, Herbert Iam as Dr. Sam Wyzak, and Martin Sheen as Senator Greg Stilson. The film's plot centers around Johnny Smith, played by Walken, who, on his way home from seeing his girlfriend Sarah, played by Adams, gets into a car accident that leaves him in a coma for five years. He awakens under the care of Dr. Sam Wyzak, who is played by Ohm, and discovers that his girlfriend is now married, and he has the ability to see one's past, present, and future when he physically touches them. He uses his gift to help local Sheriff George, played by Scourge, find a killer. He even tries to prevent a boy from drowning by warning the boy and his father that the ice pond he plays hockey on will break and he will drown. The ice is gonna break! Although they don't listen to him or heed his warnings, the boy stays home, but his friends drown due to the ice breaking. This is when Smith discovers that the future he sees can be changed. And he begins to call what he sees the dead zone. He meets a senator by the name of Greg Stilson, played by Martin Sheen, where he has a vision that he launches a nuclear strike on the USSR as president. He then goes through the rest of the movie trying to prevent it from happening, leading to a big climax at the end. As a viewer, you begin to feel for Smith, as his gift is both a blessing and a curse. Christopher Walken is masterful in presenting this. His facial expressions and vocal tone express the unhappiness Smith is feeling, and you really feel for him. While the dead zone isn't completely terrifying, it does give you a sense of uneasiness if you had a special gift that you couldn't control and caused more trouble than it was worth. If you're a fan of science fiction horror, check this one out. I can see the future! Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you again tomorrow.